Yo, what's good everybody? It's your boy Goofball Gaming back again with another video. And today, finally, got my hands on the official, official, official Madden Mobile 18 ratings. All right, now, um, these are 90, I'm 99.9% .9 sure these are going to be official because, you know, obviously this year on Madden 18, I mean Madden 17, if you look at the base elite, they're all the same track. ratings as the elite on Madden Mobile. So, I'm assuming that it will be the same as that next year. Now, they're releasing some of the players, some of the core elites from next year's game. So, I'm giving you guys these players right now. All right, let's start from the bottom here. We got Tyree Kill, um, 81 overall core elite. Now, um, think about Tyree Kill, man, 81. Hey, that would be a really good early card to pull. Uh, he seems like he'll have a lot of speed on him. Anthony Barr right there. Nate Solder, Jimmy Smith. You know, look at all these players, man. Now, it's it's weird because there's no players uh, from 83 or 82 right there. So, maybe they're not releasing all of them, all right? These are definitely not all of them. Um, but they're not releasing any 83 or 82 overall players. Here are all the 84s. They only got three of them out so far. Uh, Jimmy Smith gets an 84. Terrell Pryor, 84. Terrence Newman gets an 85. Jamie Collins plays for the Browns, gets an 85. I thought the only Browns player that get an elite is probably Joe Thomas, but I guess not. The Garrett Blunt gets an 85. He deserves that. Marcel Darius, 86. Uh, Jonathan Cyprian. Now, I didn't hear a lot about this guy next year, uh, last year, so I didn't know if he was going to be good or not, but I guess, hey, 86 overall is a base elite. That's pretty good, man. Ha Clinton Dix, 86, deserved. Dante Hightower, definitely deserved. Uh, Jarrell Casey, yep. Um, uh, Olivier Vernon, 88. And Alex Mack gets the 88. Well, I mean, if you're the Super Bowl team's uh, number one center, yeah, you deserve it, 88. Uh, let's move on to the next page here. Yeah, we have some legends as well. Lane Johnson gets an 88 as well. Um, oh, we could actually pull up their uh, cards. So, Larry Fitz. There's Larry Fitz right there. 80 speed on him. Jack Conklin. Uh, he looks like he's going to be a pretty decent uh, right tackle there. Jadavian Clowney gets a left end card. He's also 88. Cam Chancellor gets an upgrade to 88. Now, as you guys know, there are a lot of elites this year. From 80 to uh, 99 are all elites. Since I think it was like 72 to 79 or 70 to 79 are all gold so there are a lot of leads Richard Sherman actually gets a downgrade from 90 to an 89 uh, Kawan Short gets a pretty good upgrade there to 89 I think it was an 86 this year Dominique Rogers Cromartie gets a huge upgrade man he was an 83 last year so he's gonna get an 89 Sean Lee gets an upgrade as well a lot of players are getting upgrades Cameron Jordan upgrade four ratings David Johnson there you go man there's his 89 card he only has 87 speed on him which is very surprising but I'm pretty sure they're gonna release more cards uh, that uh, because this man's gonna have a spectacular season and that's gonna boost his speed. Brandon Graham gets a huge upgrade for four. Marshall Falk, here's our first legend. All right, oh, a legend with 87 speed. So he apparently has the same speed as David Johnson there. Um, oh, Ezekiel Elliott, there he is, 89 overall as well. So you know what? They didn't do him that bad. I don't think he's the same rating as David Johnson in real life, but he also had 87 speed. So, uh, oh, 76 trucking. That, that's okay. Uh, Chris Carter there. Uh, 89 overall wide receiver. Uh, he looks all right. I wouldn't be so excited about him. Odell gets an upgrade from 88 to 89. 88 speed for Odell. That is pretty good for, you know, all the Odell fanboys. Eric Weddle gets a 90, 90 overall. He was an 83 this year, man. A Ravens player getting a 90. Now, the only Ravens that I thought that was getting that high was probably Marshall Yanda. But, hey, Eric Weddle, man, welcome. Welcome. Welcome to the squad. All right. Vaughn Miller downgrade. I think he was a 91 this year or 92. I don't even remember, man. But he gets a 90 overall card. Uh, Khalil Mack gets a 90 overall card as well. So, they think Khalil Mack's as good as Vaughn Miller. And they give Khalil Mack a left end card. So, no linebacker card for Khalil Mack. Rob Gronk gets a downgrade, I think. Uh, he's a 90 overall now. 77 speed, but 90 catch. That's pretty good. Tom Brady gets an upgrade from 88 to a 90. Um, wow, that card looks good, man. Pass accuracy, throw accuracy short 92, mid uh, 90, deep is 87. Okay. Anthony Munoz, a legend. Once again, this guy gets a legend card every year. EA just keeps on signing this guy. But this guy's a beast, uh, so I don't really mind. Warren Moon gets a 91 overall QB card. Now, 73 speed. That might be higher in Madden Mobile. We'll have to see. If it is, man, I'll definitely be looking to get this guy on my squad early on. And last but not least, the last player they released is another Chris Carter. Uh, this one is different from this one right right? because this is 81, 89 one. So there's the final Chris Carter there. So, guys, these are uh, some of the My18 uh, ratings. Let me just refresh this page to see if they 
uh, give out any more. Oh, okay, they give us a Rodney McLeod. Hey, Rodney McLeod was good, was good. But yeah, that's pretty much it, man. Because right now what they're doing is they're releasing um random ones uh from every every like every time you click it. See, like if I click it again, it's gonna give me someone else. It's gonna be Mike Person. So you gotta keep keep clicking until you find uh, you find the actual person. All right, but. You know what these ones are posted up right here so i decided to do a video on that if you guys enjoyed this video man make sure you guys leave a like make sure you guys subscribe and the goof is out peace